so guys in today's video i want to show you or tell you six things you should know before coming to india hello youtube welcome to today's video i'm lucky sam i like to explore that's why this channel is called lucky sam the explorer if it's your first time seeing this channel or watching this video i'd like you to subscribe to this channel like and comment and remember at the end of every month i do giveaways on this channel so please support the growth of this channel and keep winning um gifts on this channel <laughs> so let's dive into it so six things you should know before coming to india or i think you should just know about it is number one india has the second highest population in the world yeah guys this is a fact like number one india has the second you know population in the world so the first is china and then india has um about 1.3 billion people like human beings in the country like 1.3 billion guys i think it's more than 1.3 um when it comes to those who um the people in the villages you know the smaller villages you know they're not exposed to you know technologies and other stuff so i don't think they would either way we call those numbers but i think it's more than 1.3 billion and then um when it comes to the um the the, the bigger cities like um mumbai and delhi they are about 10 million each like 10 million about 10 million in delhi about 10 million in mumbai this is crazy guys so many people like wow <laughs> so i think you should know about it before coming to india you should know that the people in india like they are many yeah they are many so number two cows are considered as sacred in, in india cows are considered as sacred and what I mean by that is, you know, cows are like God to the, them, you know. In India, the major, you know, religion in India is the Hinduism, right? Um, that is the major, is Hindu, Hinduism. So, in the Hindu religion, um, cows are, you know, treated holy, you know. So, they don't eat cows. They don't eat beef they don't eat they only take the milk but they don't eat its meat now if you try this in india you'll be put in jail like <laughs> so cows are not eaten but I'll, i'm going to make a separate video on cows being sacred in india like why indians don't eat cows when it comes to the hindu religion i'm going to make a separate and detailed video on this video so i think you should know about it so cows are considered sacred in india yes number three india is home to the famous holy festival the festival of kalis yes it's originated from india and you know um during this festival i have witnessed this festival before during this festival it's fun you know they play with water guns um water balloons with colors you know just playing songs and making merry um to their god i just don't know why they're doing that but um i'm also going to make um uh, a separate video on um the festival of colors which is the holy fest festival i'm going to make a deep 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 detailed video on the topic um holy festival so watch out for that one too so the fourth one india has the third highest amount of billionaires in the world there's no doubt it's true because it's true uh, the ceo of google he's a billionaire <laughs> the owner for tata mobiles and the other industries see there are so many billionaires in india you can research that and i'm also going to make a separate video on this one i just don't want to dive deep into it so i'm just going to make separate videos on this um, um, on this topic for you guys so i just want you to know what you should know about india before you come here or you should just know about it so this number four india has the third highest um, amount of billionaires in india 
yeah in the world sorry <laughs> so number five yes this is the interesting one did you know um snakes and ladders was originated in india you never knew right <laughs> okay so this topic i'm also going to make a separate video on it this topic is interesting it's an interesting topic but let me give you a little story about it okay so snakes and ladders the real name for snakes and ladders is mokshapat so that is the real name and then before um the british came to india you know this was used this snakes and ladders was used to you know to educate the children to teach them lessons you know um, about karma you know the lessons about karma you know um, when we say karma karma is like what goes around come back around or something like that i just don't know how it's being said properly but it's simply whatever you do to your brother you should expect the same thing whether good or bad when you give someone money you should expect that someone will also give you money if you hate on someone expect that too you someone is also going to hate on you that is karma that is the power of karma hey power of karma guys i have a project on power of karma it's a short movie um let's go back to uh the main topic so that's the power of karma like um snakes and ladders was uh in that in those days they created snakes and ladders which is the moksha path to teach children about karma when you pay evil with evil you are going to get evil when you pay good with good you're going to get good so that's what they were teaching the children all right so on the last one did you know about 70 percent of the world's spices came from india the whole world like 70 percent comes from india see let me tell you which ones like the popular ones black pepper cinnamon nutmeg paprika turmeric and vanilla all came from india <laughs> it's funny right this is crazy like um when i discovered this i was so happy i don't know like i felt so happy so yeah this is the last one 70 percent of the world spices came from india it's so amazing like i'm so happy to see that this is coming from india so if you like this video please drop a thumbs up share this video comment in the comment section and subscribe that is the important thing you have to subscribe and turn on the notification bell guys turn it on i'm done i'm lucky sam and peace